Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about application of integration. So now I will show you how to answer. Find the area between the x axis and the curve y equals to the square root of 1 plus cosine 4 x from number 0 to p. So now I will show you how to answer. We need to put about the integration from 0 to p. And we have the square root of 1 plus cosine 4 s dx. Next, we have the formula in here. That's about cosine 2a equal to 2 cosine a squared minus 1. About cosine for s, that's about number 2 multiplied by 2s. So, this one, we see that we have 2s we can put in here. And we need to change into 2 cosine 2s square minus 1. So, we put this one to replace this one. 1 minus 1, that we cancel. The square root of number 2 cosine 2 s square, you will go about the square root of number 2 and the absolute value of cosine 2 s. And now, I will put the square root of number 2 go outside in here. Now, I just concentrate about this interaction. So now, I will show you the technique how to answer this one. So, we need to wrap about cosine to s from 0 to p. So, we know that this is about 2s. That means when s equals to b over 4, cosine 2 multiplied by b over 4, you call about cosine b over 2, and you call about 0 in here. So, number 0 should be about b over this is about number 0 when s equal to number 0 you call about number 1 in here so the wrap should be like this I just draw the figure only so so when s equal to b over 4 you got about 0 in here now, if this one is about b over 2, we put b over 2 in here, and you got about cosine b. Cosine b, you got about negative number 1, but we got inside the absolute value, so you got about positive number 1. So at b over 2, they will go up again. But with how the absolute value, the graph should be go below in here for negative number 1. So, from B in here, oh sorry, 3B over 4. So, we put this one go in here, you will got about 0. So, the graph should be like this. With how the absolute value, the graph should be like this. Now at B, if we put B in here, you will go about number 1. So the area we need to concentrate, that's about this one, this one, and this one. So, from 0 to b over 4, we just use about cosine 2s dx. 
from b over 4 to 3b over 4. This is about negative, but we want the area in the positive because that is about the absolute value. So we need to put about the negative sign in here. And we have from b over 4 to 3b over 4. And we have cosine to s, the s from 3b over 4 to b. That's about positive, so we don't need to put the negative sign in here. After we analyze this one, we can calculate about this area in here. And here is about the technique, how to answer this question in here. The interaction of cosine 2 s, you got about 1 over 2, side 2 s. And we put the bounds from 0 to b over 4. The next one. We have negative 1 over 2, side 2 s, and we have the bounce from b over 4 to 3b over 4. And the last one, from 3b over 4 to b. And now we got the final answer for the first one in here. We just put about b over 4 minus psi 2 multiplied by number 0. Similar for the next one. I will put about side of 2 multiplied by 3b over 4 minus side of 2 multiplied by b over 4 and the last one that's about positive 1 over 2 side of 2 multiplied by b minus side of 2 multiplied by 3b over 4. So we calculate everything in here. And we got a final answer. So this one in here, you got bound number 2. Now we combine the answer in here. So this interaction, you got about 2. And we got the final answer. The area of this one does about this number in here. This is the end. Thank you for watching.